Hello. Welcome to Church's Chicken. This closed down about seven years ago, and the way I understand it, guy bought this is supposed to be turning this into another restaurant. So I figured we'd take a quick look around and see what we can see. Like I said, they closed about seven years ago. That's around when them hurricanes hit. A lot of places too here got really affected by Katrina and Kamel. Them hurricanes were nasty coming through here. So here is a former church's chicken. I thought we'd take a quick look around. As you can see, there's your there was your old sign for church's chicken. I don't know how much we'll see in here. I haven't had the best of luck at this. Oh, I can get a direct look. Yeah, it looks like he's been, looks like somebody's been remodeling. But then it looks like they gave up on it. You can definitely tell. It was a church's chicken. I don't mind church's chicken. Really, I don't. They have pretty good food. Their food can get greasy, though. I've been to some church's chicken where the grease is just sobbing out of the chicken. But they're a hell of a lot cheaper than what KFC or Popeyes is. And I'm not bashing anybody. A twenty, uh, an eight-piece chicken at Popeyes is like twenty-three dollars. That's just for the chicken, not the meal included. Popeyes is like sixteen. At Church's Chicken, you can get an eight piece, a ten-piece for like eight ninety-nine or ten ninety-nine or some shit. There's the menu board. You can see it's quite older. Somebody's boarded it up. You can see it's got some age to it. But I was looking at the prices. Even seven years ago. Three Texas chicken legs, mashed potatoes, and three biscuits, $11.99. And that was seven years ago. Let's see if we can order some food. Hello? Hello? Yeah, I would like some church's chicken. Yeah, I think I want a 10-piece ten dark, ten dark meat. Hello? Man, they must be understaffed. What's going on here? Anyway. There's their menu board. That's old. That has some age to it. Here's a look at the back of the building. Look at the back of the board. This is pretty cool. You can see where it has really some age. Look at the way it's decaying. Here's your, there was your parking lot, the church's chicken. The only thing I noticed about this church's chicken, as you can see the parking lot, it's got a long ass swing around to the drive-thru. If you stand back here, I mean, look at the drive through I mean, it's a long-ass swing around through the drive through There's another angle of the building. Mm-hmm.
Now, like I said, I didn't. I don't mind Church's chicken. Now, I've been to some where they're extreme. They're, the chicken was this absolute dripping, dripping in grease. But then I've been to some where the chicken was really fresh, and they were really good. Man, it's making me hungry. I might find me a Church's chicken and go get me an eight piece. Take a wide angle of the building. Now the guy just told me somebody bought this and that he's remodeling. Well, it looks like it's being remodeled inside, but then it looks like they gave up on it. If he is, I wonder what he's gonna turn it into. Well, ladies and gentlemen from I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this. I knew it wouldn't be a very long video. I think I'm gonna stand back here for a little bit, get a better shot here real quick. There we are. There's the money shot right there. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. From a former church's chicken, yum yum, to my next abandoned place, please hit the, hit the like button for me. If you're gonna walk, please, please, it helps my channel grow. Please subscribe to my channel and please share my channel. So from an abandoned church's chicken to my next abandoned place, Audi Oats. Have a great day. Stay awesome and peace.